goal of SpaceX is um, perhaps not a very commercial sounding goal at all, which is it's to really build the technologies necessary to make life multiplanetary. Um, so uh, the, the most important thing that we need to invent. Well, why is that important? Oh, I just, it's just because I think that's an important thing to do. Is it, is it because you, <laughs> well, well, no, I mean, is well, it I mean, that, why, you know, you want to answer more seriously, um, if, if you consider the nature of importance itself and say, how do you, how do you tell that anything is important? Well, uh, the, the, the lens of history is a helpful guide here. And the more you zoom out, the more you can distinguish the things that are important over a great span of time, the truly important things, mm -hmm. versus the things that may seem important in the moment, but are forgotten um, once that moment has passed. And um, if you look at the evolution of life itself, and you could say, okay, what are the major milestones? You know, it's obviously the advent of single-celled life, multicellular life, uh, differentiation to plants and animals, um, uh, life going from the oceans to land, um, mammals, consciousness. Um, you know, those are the sort of a maybe six to ten major ones on, on that scale. But I think on that scale would also fit life becoming multiplanetary. Mm. I think it would be at least as important as life going from the oceans to land. Um, arguably uh, a more important and more difficult step uh, because you've got to go over hundreds of miles of, you know, irradiated space and, you know, versus just going from the beach, from the ocean onto the beach. You know, it's like a little smaller hop. Um, so this is what motivates you. This was the vision. Yeah, it's just, it's, it's kind of, you know, this is the four, first time in the four billion year history of Earth that it's been possible, um, albeit extremely difficult, possible for life to become multiplanetary. Mm. Now that, that, that window may be open for a long time, and I'm actually fairly optimistic about the future of Earth. So I'm not someone who who thinks that Earth is is doomed and it's, it's and that doom is imminent. Um, I actually think that the most likely outcome is that uh, humanity will will last for a long time by human standards. Um, you know, at least another 10,000 years, which is right. the, kind of the length of human civilization to date. Well, 